The Free Library of Philadelphia is pleased to offer tens of thousands of ebooks. In this video, I will show you how to download ebooks to your Nook, Kobo, Sony, or other dedicated e reader. Downloading to a Kindle or a mobile device, such as an iPad or a smartphone, is a little different and is covered in other videos. Begin at our website, www.freelibrary.org, and click on the pink icon for downloadable media. From here, you'll find links to the various ebook platforms that we offer. For this demonstration, I'll download an ebook from Overdrive. Follow the link to our Overdrive catalog. From here, you can search for specific books or books by a certain author. I find that this search works best when you put the name of the author or the book you're looking for in quotation marks. More search options are available from the advanced search page. You can also browse for ebooks using the Browse Collections box on the left. Today, I'll just browse for fiction ebooks. Then I'll choose See All Ebook Fiction. This allows me to see all the fiction titles that the Free Library currently has in our collection. By clicking the Available Now tab at the top of the results page, I can see only those titles that are not currently checked out and are available for immediate downloading. I can now browse for a book. I think I will check out Buried Prey by John Sanford. Because I will be downloading to a Nook today, it's important that I check out the ebook in the correct format. For Nook, Kobo, Sony, and other dedicated e-readers, as well as iPads and smartphones and mobile devices, you will want to select the Adobe EPUB format. From here, the process is a lot like online shopping. This notice tells me that the item is now in my cart. No one else can check it out for the next 30 minutes, and I can go on to browse for more ebooks or proceed to checkout. I'll select Proceed to Checkout and enter my free library card number and PIN. Next, I select my loan period. The free library allows you to select a 7, 14, or 21 day checkout. And that's it. I now have the ebook checked out. However, Let's assume that this is my first time downloading an ebook from the free library. This message reminds me that I will need to install the Adobe Digital Edition software before I can proceed. There's a link to the software here in the Getting Started box on the left. This box is visible on every page of our OverDrive site. Once I click to install Adobe Digital Editions, I am taken to the Adobe site to complete the download. Now I have my software downloaded and an ebook checked out and ready to go. I click download. When the dialog box appears, I tell my computer to open rather than save the file. My new Adobe Digital Edition software opens automatically. Since this is my first time using the Adobe software, I will be required to log in with an Adobe ID. If you do not have an Adobe ID, follow this link to the Adobe website where you can quickly create one. Now I will register the software with my Adobe ID. And with a few clicks, my book opens and I can start reading. To transfer my ebook to my Nook, I plug my Nook into the PC using the USB cable. I have to authorize my device when I'm using it for the first time. If I switch to the library view in Adobe Digital Editions, I now see that my Nook has become a bookshelf location in the Adobe Digital Editions software. I can click and drag my new ebook into my Nook. Then I can eject the Nook from my PC and start reading. If you run into trouble, return to our OverDrive site and take a look at their help section. Most questions can be easily answered here. If you get stuck, scroll down to support to contact the free library by email, and we'll do our best to help you out. Thanks for supporting eBooks at the Free Library of Philadelphia.